Hello everyone, welcome to my channel or welcome back. Um, today I will be showing you guys my room tour. I did a room tour about a year ago. Um, my room was pretty empty compared to now. Um, that's my mascara under my eyes. Um, but yeah, I decided to do another room tour because everyone loves my room on TikTok. Okay, so my camera doesn't want to focus on me. Uh, my room is super dark right now because it's New Jersey weather. It's literally, literally snowing, I think, already. But anyway, champ. But anyways, I will be doing a room tour today. Um, let me show you guys a little bit of everything in my room. Um, my room is a very... Not messy, but it's really full of stuff. It's cluttered in a way. Um, but yeah, I just have a small room. And here's the star of the video. Hi, Cam. Hi, Cam. He tried running away from us this morning. And we had to get him in the front of the house. So this is my door, it is white, um, and it has a literal antique, I think. It is an antique doorknob, and I have the key to it, so it locks. Um, I have this nightgown with someone's initials on it. Um, I thrifted, and it's super old. I'm pretty sure it's from like the 1920s or 30s. And I have that little vintage hanger and a little uh, rack up there so I can hang stuff. I have bamboo mirrors here. Hollywood Regency from like the 60s or the 50s. Then I have this 1950s Pepsi Cola um, bottle opener because I really like drinking soda, especially Pepsi. But it's just super bad, but you know. Then I have this corner here, um, which I didn't really know what I wanted to do with it at first, but I found this mirror. It used to be a door there, um, which I was going to turn into a mirror, um, but it's in the hallway now. So I put this mirror here. My mom painted every single mirror in my room, by the way. And I thrifted this little purse. I think it might be hand-painted. I'm not really sure. And then we found this little mannequin. My aunt gave me some necklaces. I have that little Chanel box. I have a literal, literal full Pepsi bottle there. And then I have this vintage hair dryer there as well that my aunt gave me. And this vintage umbrella. Um, I also have this like 1940s tennis racket there and I have this little mini chair with like lipsticks there which are also old. They're like from the 1950s and 60s. My mom's 90s juicy tubes from Lancome. This lip gloss is from the 90s. I still use it. I mean it's still pretty good. It smells delicious. I put my Juicy Couture Gold Couture perfume here, which I've had ever since it la launched in like 2014. Then I have this little Avon perfume. I think it's from Avon. I'm not really sure. And I have this air purifier from my friend. She gave me because I have really bad allergies. So, yeah. Then here is that little shelf up there. Um, I think I also thrifted that one. My aunt gave it to me. I have a little fan. I have a little um lennox clock i have that art novo vase and pink glass and then i have a little carousel i have this little beehive 1950s amber swag swag lamp whatever you want to call it and there's my fire alarm i think about these lamps i put light bulbs um that are smart bulbs um i think they're phillips and i can just control it on my phone um through the wiz app so I have every single light in my room on here and I could just click my bedroom and I can turn them all on and I can turn them all off like that. Uh, so yeah, it's pretty cool. It's super easy at night as well because I have my Google Mini here and I just tell her to like turn off all my lights even though she gets annoying sometimes. It's the amber lamp. So I will tell Google to turn off or turn on my amber lamp and it'll just be that lamp that she will turn on or turn off. Then I have this little shelf up there, which is a Pottery Barn shelf. My mom has had these. I think she found them at my dad's job. But it's a Pottery Barn shelf, and I got like little Chanel boxes of- not purses. Bags from like perfumes and makeup that I bought. And then I have that little brass vase or vase, whatever you want to call it there as well. Um, here is my supposed vanity, even though I don't even use this mirror anymore, because what am I supposed to look at? Like, I have to like go like this to look at myself. Um, but yeah, I have pompas there. I have this beautiful Art Deco lamp that my aunt gave me, which also has a smart bulb. Um, I have my favorite, one of like my favorite old Hollywood actresses, um, 
musical sheet there, Cover Girl, Rita Hayworth. And then I have a bunch of stuff here. <laughs> and I love it, but sometimes it just drives me crazy. Um, first of all, this lamp, my mom actually thrifted this glass and she also thrifted the milk glass um, base separately. And then she painted this because I hate silver. Um, and yeah, it just looks super cute. And she got me that little blue cobalt whale. It's hand blown from Italy. Um, and then I have a bunch of vintage perfume bottles here. Um, I have, these are, I don't use any of these. I don't put perfume in any of these just because I don't want to stain them or anything. Um, but yeah, um, I'm not sure what your, which is which. I think this is Avon and it's from like the 70s. I have two of those. And then I got this little koi fish from when I bought a birdhouse, bird cage, I mean. And then I have this little powder, um, container there for my makeup. Um... And yeah, these are all glass. These have little pumps. They don't really work anymore. They're all like worn down. They're literally broken. Here's my Google Mini. And then here I thrifted this little heart, this little porcelain heart um, trinket box. I thrifted it yesterday and I just filled it up with like a bunch of earrings, um, like study earrings and all that that don't fit in my other containers. So I put that there and it looks super cute. I love it. And I have my little Coco Chanel um, perfumes. I have this milk glass um, vase with like my makeup brushes and sponges. I have the little ma milk make. I have that milk bottle uh, full of pompas as well. I have this little lipstick holder. I have some products that were sent to me as well, like Bread Beauty, Gizu or Gizu. This vintage hand mirror here. This candlestick holder. That super cute like little glow snow globe that my mom got me as well. Um, I have that little mannequin full of jewelry. I used to have it more full of jewelry. I just decided to like clean it up a bit. And I have that little clock in the back that used to glow in the dark, I think. I have that little um, oil lamp. I have my jewelry in here, like most of my clip-on earrings and all that. Um, this super cute Hollywood star that my friend gave me. So cute, I love it. And I just put it here in the front just so that I can see it. Um, and I have lighters because I, I'm obsessed with lighters. I don't know why. I don't smoke. I don't do anything with lighter, lighters. Um, I have my dad's first Jean-Paul Gaultier perfume that my mom had gotten him when they started, when they got married or they started dating. I'm not really sure. And I have this little milk glass, uh, little Victorian booty. And yeah, I have little trinket boxes or containers everywhere in my room. And all my furniture is beige. That stool my mom painted pink, which I think I will be painting white or beige because it's all messed up already. Then I have this armor, a little ducky up there and a little uh, trunk. Um, and yeah, it just has like really beautiful brass um, knobs, which none of my clothes fit in there to be honest. Here is like everyone's favorite spot in my room, I think. Um, so I got this mirror. It was also trash. That huge mirror was literally trash and we picked it up. My mom cleaned it and painted it for me. It's from the 70s. It's also plastic. Um, then we got all those little mini mirrors that my aunt also gave me some of them. My mom bought some of them. Um, I have more pompas there, more tennis rackets. Then I thrifted this little Art Deco glass vase yesterday. I have that little amber glass candle lighter there. Um, I don't even know what it's called. Um, but then I have these little suitcases here, which are my favorite. Um, that is a hat box from the 60s, American Tourister. Then I have this first trunk that I ever bought my entire life, and it was super expensive. Um, don't ever do that. <laughs> that was like a big mistake, but also I've never seen a trunk this small in my entire life. Um, so yeah, it was worth it at the same time, but it was so much money because this doesn't even close, right? Okay, it doesn't lock anymore. Um, and I need to repaint it because it's all messed up because I put my feet up there when I used to like um, I don't even know where I used to keep this thing but yeah then I have this little clock that I also thrifted I have ashtrays everywhere in my room as well but I keep them for like um, lozenges or like cough drops I have this YSL box that my dad got for Christmas with this perfume and then I have little golf balls and I have my little swan there. This is like one of my favorite spots ever. Um, I got this little bench um, and I put a little fluffy pillow on it. My mom painted it as well. Um, I have my typewriter in here. And then I have this little briefcase that I also thrifted here. And then I got my little Jacobo's earmuff headband there. 
my little Tiffany box there. And then I have my makeup train case under my bench. Um, here I used to have a bigger bench, like one that literally took up almost all the space. I sold it because um, I didn't want it anymore because I have another one that I thrifted and it's super like, bougie and uh, fancy and all that. So I will be painting that one and I most likely will be placing this one here. Um, so I'll see where I'm going to put all of this stuff once I get that ready and put there. Um, and yeah, I think it's going to fit like super cute. And, I and then I have this part here which... I put a little window there, ballerina shoes, uh, lamps, candles, um, hotel bell, and I have my radio here for putting my vinyls, my cassette tapes, and my CDs. Um, I have this little hair dryer, if you guys didn't see my TikTok. I have this camera here, which I can no longer find film for because it's not made anymore. Then I have all, like hand mirrors, brushes there that I barely even use. Um, I have more stuff here. This is a whole mess, okay? Like that I will say. I have CDs everywhere. I have like um, dead stock makeup. I have glass booties as well. I have my makeup bag. I have cups. I have little contact books and all that. Um, I have lighters in here. Um, I have a little mini coffee grinder that's not even useful. Um, I have more lighters there as well. I have like brooches. I have more stuff here. I have like my little swan full of random things. I have a little powder container there. I have another Coke bottle. I have more ashtrays with like jewelry. Lipstick container. A little bell and my little lion. This is- this right here is full of cameras that I don't even use. Okay, that I will say. I don't use any of that stuff. Also, something cool I have is this like tape measure from like I don't even know what, 1930s or 1940s. It's fabric. To wind it back, you just go like that. And you lock it. Super cool. One of my literal, literal favorite spots because it has like my books and it has my vinyls. And I have more than this amount of vinyls. I will tell you. I have my Stephen King books that I thrifted. I have a little Coca-Cola bear. Then I have my Gizu, Gizu. Uh, Holiday puzzle, which I never completed. Then I have Duran Duran. I have Blondie. I have Diana Ross. I have Shade. I have Elton John. Um, I have a lot of vinyls. I love listening to music in vinyl form. And I have this holder for my vinyls as well. And I put plastic coverings on every single one of them so that they don't get ruined. Um, I have this other mirror here my mom painted. I have another pottery bar shelf there with a perfume, an oil lamp, and a clock. And I have these little fans. This is my closet. I will not open it because it's a literal mess. Um, then I have this mirror here, which I usually keep here in a corner. Not not here, but here in a corner. Um, then I have this French lamp. And I put little points, point ballet shoes here, which I uh, bought off of eBay. Then I have... Crystal, door, uh, crystal knobs for like my curtains. I have this Hollywood lamp. So cute. I This is one of my favorite lamps. Is it like, and you just turn it on by here. But I turn it on, my, I have turned it on through my phone now. I have this mirror here, which I love because it's like such a weird spot. This thing disturbs me a bit, but you know, still cute. And then I have a lot of jewelry here my diffuser, um, and my little plants, more jewelry, more swans, more art deco, pompas, more tennis rackets, pedestal, which my mom has had for like 20 years already. Then I have a bunch of other knickknacks here. I have like the little sheep coin, coin bank, little bears having a tea party in the back, little horse, little shoe, then I have more vases, more perfume bottles on there, my little champ, Mickey, Minnie Mouse, my friend gave me. And then I have this basket down here, which is like full of my Nintendo, my cassettes, and my Harry Styles mini vinyl. Here's my mannequin or my dress form, whatever you want to call it. I bought this before the pandemic by a New York, um, a guy who works in like setting up like production sets. So that was pretty cool. He was pretty nice. Um, I got two of these. So I dressed her up for like Christmas for the holiday, Chanel scarf, and then this little lace bralette that I've had for years already. 
and its little pearl necklace with the crown. Then I have um, this lamp here, which was one of the first lamps that I ever put in my room. And um, I have a little telephone here that everyone just, I have this telephone here that everyone just loves. So cool, it still works. I would just have to connect it. Um, then I have this shoe here, this little br brass um, container, the little ashtray as well. My little tissue holder, my clocks. This is like a condiment container from the 1940s. Little sewing machine, a storage book, um, my hoteles, beauty, hair, hair tie containers, a little glass cat candle holder, Apple Watch, more jewelry in here. Um, I have this sign that I got before the pandemic as well, I think. And I have this Beverly Hills sign that I got in like 2017 from LA, my first trip. And then I got this mirror um, a while ago, my mom painted as well. Then I got this little ballet shoe that I thrifted. Um, it's brass and then I have this cameo um, wall plaque then I have everyone's favorite mirror I think this is everyone's literal favorite mirror um, everyone just compliments this <laughs> um, it's a fireplace mantle mirror but I put it behind my bed it is peeling a bit but I will not be painting it until like the near future and then I got these little Japanese hand fans which I love I fell in love with that stuff when I saw it and my mom just like sprayed them with like clear spray paint so that they don't get ruined um, because it is very delicate paper. And then I have my bed here. It's also beige, <laughs> all beige bedding. I got these pillows, um, at a thrift store. And then I have these, like, Japanese blankets that I always use. They're so comfy. It's supposed to, like, be faux mink fur. I have this wall full of little frames. I have my little, um, uh, light switch here which my brother bought off of eBay. Um, it was one of the first things that, that I also added to my room. That's pretty much it. Um, I have a lot of things in my room, but literally I can't even speak. My tongue keeps getting stuck. Um, I need water. <laughs> but yeah, my room's small. I mean, it looks pretty big a little bit, but it's pretty tiny. Um, this has been my childhood bedroom for the last, like, what? for the last like 13 years. Um, it used to be all pink, if you guys remember the old iconic videos for me. Um, but I now put it all all beige, it's all neutral now. It's all vintage. And yeah, I just, I'm very proud of my room. My mom helped me so much with my room, my dad. And um, yeah, it's just super cute. And I always change like a few things up in my room. I just took out all the Christmas decorations that I put, which were like really tiny. Um, but yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed my room as much as I do. Uh, um, I'm always posting room content on TikTok and Instagram if you want to go see that stuff. Um, if you guys want like close-ups or whatever, um, definitely go check that out. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video.